My voice is gone. I'm not sounding good. But I feel okay. It's literally just my throat. About to go on adventures with Eva. Well, I guess just like errands. You guys will see. Go. Well, is it still morning? It is 11 <laughs> Almost <laughs> noon. And we're like, good morning. Good morning. morning. We're both sick. <laughs> Very sick. I've just risen from like what five six days of, like, in bed, bed rest like yeah. in bed have not left <laughs> the room it sounds like that but i'm like i swear i'm good it's just like all right here so like what it's is all that? in the face like a cold yeah i'm just gonna get night i'll be fine we'll be fine <laughs> oh yeah look as in our long aritzia puffs and uggs yeah we're literally the same right now <laughs> we got the goods you guys hopefully this makes me better <laughs> next stop <laughs> He's getting juices that will fix us. I know they all look good. Turmeric, I feel like, is so good. Ooh, I love pear. Green kale, celery, cucumber, broccoli. I've never had one with broccoli in it. We came for juice and are leaving with everything under the sun. <laughs> I'm making them my famous chicken salad. And they're gonna love it. And we got guac. Oh, wait, I really gotta show them. We're so excited for these. We done snickerdoodle mush. I'm so pumped. Like that is gonna be so Wrapped up on a wipe. <gasps> no, my battery's dying. Okay, we have to do it quick. Okay. Wait. What are we doing? Turmeric? Yeah. Turmeric or the or turmeric pineapple? Yeah, turmeric. The turmeric is pineapple, lemon, ginger, turmeric, cayenne. Okay. Let's do this baby quick. I don't think I can do it all at once. Like I'm gonna no, you have two to. sips. You just like start chugging. You just like a shot. Drink. Come on, cheers. Oh, it doesn't smell good. Okay, Three, here two, we go. One. Ooh, the kick. Okay, it wasn't as bad as I thought. I feel like the, the pineapple kick. makes it taste fruity, but the cayenne is burning my throat. That feels okay, good. I'm, my throat's on fire. It's a good burn. That's a good burn. <laughs> Round two. <laughs> Should we do our other one? No, is that crazy? Do we save it or do we do it? Orange, carrot, lemon. I like, feel like I could keep it going. I feel like we should keep with should the we momentum. Do it? Okay, we're doing we're our other do one it. too. Booster shot. Orange, carrot, lemon, turmeric. Asparagus. Asparagus. Wait, I want to see how Grape you seed. do it. You want to see? You just like <laughs> sip it. I, I need to watch you. You want me to do it? Yeah, you go first. Oh, see, yeah, you're so good at it. Cause I feel like I down fill up my mouth. Down the hat. Oh, that one's worse. That one's worse. See, it like fills up my mouth. Yeah. The oregano. I need like three tries. Yeah, that. Whew. I think I don't know how to pour and drink at the same time. <laughs> I have to pour, and then when it fills up my mouth, I have to swallow, and then I have to I do it. I feel like shots kind of like prepared me. Oh. Now I take anything. Like vodka's <laughs> worse. So. Yeah, true. Vodka is worse than that. Okay, now we're going to start on our favorite place. <laughs> Today. Good, how are you? I am doing fantastic. Thank you so much for asking. Aww. What can we make happen for you? Um, can I please get a grande Americano Misto with oat milk and one pump of sugar free vanilla, please? <laughs> that sounds fancy. I was like, what even is <laughs> that? I'm not sure. Hold on one second. I'm just going to take a, a friend for this one. She's probably like, what is that? It's probably your Canadian order cutting yeah, out. Yeah. And here they're like, what is Grande. it? Thank you so much. You got it, no worries. 964, we'll see you out the window. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> he was Canadian is coming out. They were so sweet. Ever. Okay, literally that definitely, so nice. that order you get in Canada is definitely just called something different here. No, it is. Because they were like, we well, don't know what that <laughs> is. That was really cute, but they were so sweet trying anyway. to figure it out. <laughs> and the they have a kid's temperature button. Um, I can't believe that. Everyone yes, said you could ask for a couple ice cubes, kids temp, and they knew kids temp right away. So that's my new go-to if I'm getting something What's hot, is asking for a kids temp. You guys, I wish I was just walking when you said that. I know. Eva's right, we have been dealing with so many nice people. So many nice people. Like, like everyone's been foods. so nice. Okay. So I Googled sappy. it and I figured out why there was, it was lost in translation. <laughs> Literally on Reddit 2015. So this has been going Years. on for a while. This says, in Canada, Americano Misto is espresso, hot water, and steamed milk. In the US, when I order that, they look at me strangely and, and don't know what it is. So what is, we should ask McKenna because she's a barista, but what is espresso, hot water, and steamed milk in America called then? Just Americano? 
No, because that's because just espresso and water. Just, yeah, just black. So you could say Americano and add steamed milk. I don't know. I know you that's guys what I was trying know. to say, but I feel like comment down below. Coffee? How do you order that here? Espresso, hot water, steamed milk. I don't know. Because I just get like cold iced coffee. I'm boring. Yeah, I was trying to be fancy with a hot drink. But <laughs> okay, and the kids' temperature. See, I think that's easier to do with like hot chocolate or coffee, but with tea, since it just comes out, it like I, everyone is damning me this too. It comes out as like a 200 degree like boiling water. Like that's just how hot the tap is. Like they can't make it colder. Yeah, it's so hot. So then I think they just have to like throw some ice cubes in there. So maybe order it that way. I don't know. Or she's like, I can make the lemonade part colder. They were so accommodating. Know, but they I were really sweet trying to get it right. And we were like, we are like taking up all your time. Like just ignore us. <laughs> Just get us, give us whatever you got. Oh, or not just give me coffee. Once again, the best Starbucks ever. Literally the best Starbucks. Later, I'm home. Ignore the voice, you guys. I actually am feeling okay. Like, obviously a little under the weather. Um, but I just feel like I sound a lot worse than I feel, you know? And I don't know about you guys, but when I'm sick and I'm just like lazy, lounging around, luckily I've been like resting since I've been home. Even I had our wellness morning, <laughs> but yeah, I've been like resting ever since. I'm like, I need to cook some like real nutritious food right now, cause that's gonna help me instead of like sitting here all day, living off of tea and day quilt, you know what I mean? Like I always feel worse if I'm like not eating, especially not eating good food. So I'm so happy. HelloFresh is like a lifesaver that my HelloFresh got delivered this week. This is the one pan pork fajita lettuce wrap. I actually haven't had this recipe before, so I'm so excited. And you guys, something you should know about HelloFresh, I found this out because if you're dumb like me and maybe possibly potentially threw away the recipe cards with the box that I came in and I'm so dumb. There's literally a QR code on this bag that you can scan, you click on their website and look at literally the recipe comes right up how nice so that i can just go off of this instead of um, having my recipe cards inside through it by accident look you can literally it's like step-by-step -step instructions just as if you had the card so that's so nice thank goodness they have all the recipes on their app but you guys already know how much i love hello fresh i've literally ordered hello fresh for years and years like we're talking like four years like through college and you guys go back to have our own subscription that we can for because we just love them so much and the food tastes way better than if i try to make my own concoction on my own especially during the holiday season when it like can just be so hectic hellofresh just cuts out the stressful grocery shopping obviously so it can just be very simple ingredients recipes that are all like pre-portioned pre-packaged that with a meal that limit meal prep limit food waste, everything like that. So it's so awesome. This one literally says 15 minutes, you guys. I'm so happy, I'm so happy. And this is such a quick and easy one since I want to go lay in bed again. <laughs> but this is gonna be so good to eat like a pork lettuce wrap. Like we're getting some meat, we're getting some veggies. I'm so excited right now. Also, you guys, if you were someone like me who gets sick of recipes so easily, like I said, this one I haven't had before, so I'm so excited. I love picking out new recipes. I highly recommend downloading their app because I will just look on their app each week. They have new recipes in there to like break out of your recipe rut. So if you guys haven't tried out HelloFresh before, seriously, I'm the number one fan. Like I really am. I just could not. Recommend. I'll have them linked down below. I know you guys go to HelloFresh.com. You can use my code at ggyt14. You'll get 14 free meals plus three free gifts so they're amazing and i'm so excited to eat some real food right now instead of tea and dayquil like i said and let's get cooking Oh my goodness, you guys, I could not even wait. I already ate my third one right here. Look at these. Okay, this might have to be my new favorite HelloFresh just because it was so quick. This is definitely the quickest HelloFresh I've ever done and easy, especially by myself, especially when I freaking sound like this. And the cheese just like melts and the meat and then the crushed tortilla chips. Oh my goodness, with the sour cream and the lime. Oh, and it's just so fresh with the lettuce wraps, especially if you get HelloFresh already, you guys. 
Mm, 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 mm. I would so recommend trying out this recipe if you haven't tried it before. I don't know how I haven't picked this one out before. Maybe I just like the challenge and like picking ones that like would take longer. I don't know. I'm happy past me last week who was picking out recipes this week thought about how I would want a quick and easy lunch. Mm, 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 mm. Okay, so I just keep eating. <laughs> you guys. And the fajita spice, I just, I have no words. This is exactly what I needed. It's gonna bring me back to health. <laughs> but again, if you haven't tried a HelloFresh before, what are you doing? Join me and all my faves that do HelloFresh. Cause like, it's the best. You can skip a week whenever you need. You can change a delivery day. I'm always doing that because we all know, I never know when I'm gonna be here or visiting Max or where we're gonna be. Schedule's always up in there. So it's just like literally so convenient. I'll have it linked down below, hellofresh.com. Again, use my code GGYT14 and get to up, you can get up to 14 free meals and three free gifts. So it's unreal. I'm gonna finish eating my lunch and then why don't we get back in bed? <laughs> Mm -hmm. Good morning, you guys. It's the next morning. I am finally getting around to wrapping some presents. Are you gonna help me? Okay, don't go too close to the scissors, please. Oh, yeah. Okay, why do you keep going towards the scissors? I don't want them to hurt you. Ready to turn on the camera? You go a little crazy, huh? <laughs> Are you helping mom wrap presents? Yeah. Okay, you guys, I have a theory. Either you are someone that loves wrapping presents and you're good at it. So you love it, it's fun, you wrap right as you get the gifts, exciting, look cute under the tree. Or me, and you hate wrapping gifts and you're really bad at it. Me, I'm just so bad, no matter how hard I try, so bad. Um, I've actually gotten tips from you guys. So I remember last year I wrapped everything, I took them out of the boxes and tried to wrap and so then it would be like, a squishy sweatshirt or blanket or something so it wouldn't look as good wrapped but then if it's in the box it looks nicer hi clinger why are you so clingy right now <laughs> so i kept all these things in the boxes and so what i'm trying to do you can tell i'm wrapping early on this year sorry my voice is so horrible and i'm trying to get ahead of it and wrap over time and so I just set out three gifts. These are actually all for Max. And that way, it's not like how it usually is, where it's like the day before, and I'm like, oh my gosh, and I have so much to wrap, and it takes me forever. I'm like all stressed. I'm like, Gretchen, set aside some time. Just do it. Are you guys with me here? Like, I saw an Instagram poll the other day. Someone I followed was like, do, do you enjoy wrapping gifts or do you do not? And it was like 80% yes that you enjoy. And I'm like, I can't relate. I think because I'm bad at it, I don't enjoy it. Um, so we just have some wrapping paper. See, and this is where I mess up too. Like, is this big enough for this package? Like, I don't know. Maybe it almost is. So this is where I have an issue too. I run into so many like fails where I'm like, this will be perfect. And then I don't even have enough wrapping paper for the thing that I'm wrapping. Oh, it's so close. Okay, let's try this way. Will that make a difference? Uh, nope, that made it worse. Oh, okay. Oh, then maybe I can do... Let's see if this one looks better. Oh, I think this could be a winner. Yeah, because this isn't this thick. Okay, here we go. I am so proud of myself right now. Oh my goodness. I mean, this is probably very like average and not that amazing. But for me, this is so good. Usually there's like a brown spot where I didn't have enough paper or like the ends look really horrible. Okay, you know what? I think now that I'm doing this, I could realize, I could see how one would find this therapeutic and nice. If you take the time, you're doing a good job. I have you guys to thank, honestly, for tips that I've gotten over the past couple years of vlogmas. I feel like I always show wrapping presents because it's just like fun and festive and yeah, the holidays. I don't know, I just think it's like in the Christmas spirit for vlog. But you guys have told me in the past, I feel like I used to do it on my bed. <laughs> and so that would be so hard. Everyone's like, no, you need like a hard surface, which I guess, yeah, this is good. Like it's carpet, but it's still like flat. Um, and then I would wrap like soft sweaters and stuff like I said. So you guys gave me 
the tips of doing it on a hard surface and like keeping it in a box and it looks so nice oh my gosh max lucky you when your gifts look so nice this year. <laughs> okay let's try this one again Brody. why am i okay maybe you go get more all right these are our last two rolls so hopefully this is enough for what i'm trying to do right now let's try oh okay <laughs> oh yeah we got a lot here okay D minus, huh? That was a really bad job. Okay, you have to be <laughs> right in the middle of everything. Don't step on it. You're gonna rip it. Come this way. Thank you. <laughs> you have something else. Okay, let's hope that this big enough. Did I not? Oh my gosh, I'm gonna be so mad at myself. Please, no! Brody, no! No, absolutely not. Brody, Brody, I just assumed that this would work. Are you kidding me? Okay, okay, here we go. Okay. I think this is even worse. Oh, uh, why did I do this? We are just gonna have to make this work because what the heck? Oh, it's like an inch away. Maybe Max won't know. <laughs> this is just gonna have to be like this because I don't want to waste this wrapping paper. <laughs> no, this is just okay. This gets a grade F. I failed. Brody, this is embarrassing. Uh, your dad is not going to be impressed. We're just going to flip it the other way, though, and hope we'll never know. Nobody's going to know. You know what I could do? Oh, yeah, because there's a lot of extra on the ends. I'm going to go like this. Ooh, we did it. We did it. Genius. I mean, it's not gonna look pretty, but then at least there's no brown showing. Clearly, you can tell. I feel like I'm a perfectionist in some areas of life, and then in others, I'm like, forget it. We did it! Okay, this one's definitely not perfect, but like, nobody's gonna know. Nobody is gonna know. Wow, I can't believe that worked to cover that little brown spot up. Okay, this is probably so boring for you guys. I will spare you the details of doing this one. This is gonna be crazy. You guys can probably tell what this is. Comment down below. Guess what that gift is. Um, I'm gonna end this off here since this is probably getting so long. Thank you guys for watching. Love ya and see you in my next video.